So you might be in a weird position where for some reason your file transfer on your Android phone just isn't working out that well. Now what does this mean? Well basically it means that your file transferring, you know, whether you're Bluetooth filing or whatever, these transfers aren't working out properly. And the best thing you're going to want to do here is the first thing I recommend doing is making sure your Bluetooth options are enabled on all your devices. So making sure that your particular phone, you know, your you know, Bluetooth phones on either one of your devices are properly enacted and intact and you're actually connecting your particular Bluetooth device to this Bluetooth device too. Make sure your Bluetooth is on here. Make sure your Bluetooth is on your other device as well. The other thing is if you're transferring a big file, let's say you're transferring a really, really big file from your Android phone to another Android device or another Bluetooth whatever device, the biggest thing you can do here is to make sure you're not canceling out of that particular file transfer, especially if it's a big application. Like I said, if it's a big app or it's a big you know thing that I'm transferring, the best thing you can do here, like if I'm wanting to go ahead and share this out or whatever, right? If I click share, the biggest thing I want to do is I don't want to go ahead and move away from that device while I'm sharing it. And I don't want to go and cancel out of that sharing or turn off my phone or anything like that while the file is transferring. So if you're transferring from Bluetooth, like I said, you can usually hold down on a file, click on share, and you should be able to see it. The biggest thing you can do here is just not cancel out of it. That's the next thing I'd recommend doing. If that's still not working, you can try restarting your phone. So hold down the buttons you normally would to like restart your device. You can go and hold those buttons down, go and restart it. That might end up fixing it. And you might want to go through and actually update your Android phone as well. If your phone hasn't been updated in a while or if it has some issues, go click into your settings application here inside of your Android device. You want to scroll all the way down and click on software update. You want to click on download and install right up here. And you're just going to want to download and install the latest update that's available on your Android phone. For a majority of people, that's pretty much all you're going to have to do. And that might end up fixing it for you. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so long.